Hello, so how's everybody doing today? Um, so today I want to make a quick video just explaining um, a little cool resource that I got. Um, it was a free resource. Well, you just had to pay for shipping and handling. And I mentioned in my last video, and I said I was going to do a review, and here I am 15 weeks later. Well, not 15, but maybe like a week or two later. Um, and this is the Med Geeks book. And I love their little symbol there. This is Med Geek's little pocket book that they put out. Very thin, very small, very lightweight, and it could fit in like a lab coat or something like that. And it says board review pocket book on the front. Uh, Med Geek's I think is geared more towards uh, PAs or, or people who are in PA school, but like the inside of this book says for any physician, nurse practitioner, PA student. And what does this little book have, you may ask? Well, uh, so it has two sections, a medicine section and a uh, meaning, you know, disease section. Um, and then it has a section for uh, medications. So, for example, you'll have a section here. This is the medicine section, it's cardiology. And it'll have different diseases or different things here. Right, like CHF, and it'll just have little memorization, um, um, you know, tips. So it'll say, uh, or a factor association with CHF would be orthopnea. Uh, let's see, what's another one? Venous distension, jugular venous distension, or um, cardiogenic shock would be um, hypotensive, cool, clammy skin, and MI. So just little pointers to help you remember certain things. Maybe you're like, hey, you know, I forgot uh, before a test. Uh, then you go back to the pharmacology page. And the cool thing about this is it has a lot of medications that you don't see normally. Because, I mean, everybody knows, you know, you see metformin or lisinopril or certain medications. But, um, you know, this will have medications in it, for example... Uh, well, like for ALS, uh, well, I use all, I think that's the only FDA approved um, or treatment uh, medication for ALS, for example. So that'll be in here, and it'll, it'll have just kind of the same thing, different pointers. Um, it, it'll say, you know, uh, what is it used for? Uh, when is this used? Um, let's see, what else? Now they're just kind of little pointers like that, you know, uh, norepinephrine used for septic shock, uh, different things like that. Um, so for seven dollars shipping and handling, not bad. I mean, it, it's my only complaint is it's not very, uh, it's not a lot of information for each disease. There's just like three, four, or five, maybe six different little pointers for each like disease or whatever. Um, so I kind of wish it was maybe even a little, I, I know it's thin and easy to carry, lightweight. Those are the positives. Only $7 you're paying for the shipping and hand, handling, so it's essentially free. Um, and Med Geeks, they have a great uh, podcast that you can listen to um, with quick uh, reviews on uh, different topics like syncope or, or whatever, like, like a, maybe a symptom or a certain disease. They'll have like a review going over that. Um, disease process and you can find the uh, I listen to Med Geeks on, on uh, Spotify because I have the Spotify premium because I'm a music junkie and uh, but anyway so that's kind of you know that's the cool thing about uh, this book is that it's smaller and easy to carry around wish I had just a little bit more information that would be my critique um, or my negative um, so what I did is there's so you know little spaces where you can write stuff i put some uh lab values like iron levels and hemoglobin hemoglobin levels hematocrit levels and things like that just you know a quick reminder here in the hematology section so that way i made my kind of my own little you know thing here because each page has got some space in the margins and stuff where you can where you can write or, or whatever 
I think there's even a space in the back, like if you want to put something here. So overall, yeah, I think it's I think it's worth it. Um, I, I think you know for them it's kind of a promo thing. It's got their uh, their YouTube channel here. Um, like I said, they have a lot of uh, great podcasts, but I think you can also listen to the same ones on YouTube, um, their Facebook page, and their um, their Instagram, which I think I'll follow them on all three, which leads me, hey, follow me on all three. Well, yeah, follow me on all three. <laughs> I have all three. I was like, well, do I have all three? Um, but anyway, if you uh, just need something cheap, quick, and easy to you know to review with when you're like the other day i was sitting at my son's baseball game and i just pulled this out it was easy i just pulled, pulled it out i had it in my back pocket actually the fit and just reviewed real quick I had a quiz coming up and you know some of the pointers helped me out but anyway y'all have a great day and i hope to make some more videos soon